Now we'll talk about the short jacking features of this aerial. With the outriggers on, once we move a jack up off of the ground, you will see a rapidly blinking amber LED light for that outrigger that you've moved. We'll move the outrigger in approximately two feet and deploy the jack back down to penetrate the ground. Once the jack has penetrated the ground, the amber light will begin to blink slowly. This is telling the operator that he is in a short jack situation. You can see now that the amber indicator light is now blinking slowly. Red outrigger not extended light is illuminated. As you can see, we're in a short jack situation. The aerial smart system is constantly monitoring outrigger deployment. It's also monitoring aerial elevation, aerial extension, and aerial load. It will allow us to travel over a short jacked outrigger only if it is safe. We'll now operate the aerial in a short jack situation. You can see the red outrigger not extended light is now illuminated, advising the operator that he is short jacked. We'll turn the aerial power switch to high, elevate the aerial up, We'll extend out. You can see that we are in a safe zone yet for load. We'll rotate the aerial over the short jack. You can see now the aerial is reading an overload situation due to the short jack and the outrigger not extended light is flashing. To get out of this situation, I can retract the aerial or elevate the aerial up. Back in a safe zone, outrigger not extended light no longer flashing, overload light not on or flashing. I can now continue my work over the short outrigger.